All right, everybody, welcome back. We have an antidote to make, and the first stop on our journey is going to be over here. We will need to go back to the West End to face Lord Redgrave, and there are a ton of people in this area that are sick. So I figure it's probably a good idea to head over here first. Now, it looks like they're in the, he's somewhere in the cemetery, so we'll go the back way. I am hoping that my kindness and generosity in not killing him will make getting that antidote easy, but you never know. I might have to fight him again, which will suck. Best run of it's not Ow. The power of the Lord <laughs> The power of the Lord and smack. Ow. Ow ow ow. Really? You're gonna... That's what happens. That's what happens to people who are mean to me. Okay, there's some healing. Stuff from you guys. Alright. Back at it. No blood. Oh, hello, my rat friends. This is despicable. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? There was another one here. I have this thirst for blood. Quietly, quietly. You will never notice I am here. Well, ah, dig it. Are you sure? No. No, you won't. Uh, he's he's not watching out for those teeth. He did a bad job. Okay. Ow, 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 ow. There we go. Uh, no. <laughs> Starting to use this stake a bit more now. Ow! Don't spray me with that junk. That's gross. Uh, sir, I can't get around you. Okay, then. At least I will heal up to that line eventually, so... Not too bad. That is, though. That's definitely bad. Okay. Why are there so many of you people? This was mine! Why are you all in the red? Ow! Dang it! 
I don't have the stamina for all this. <laughs> Your blood is mine. Okay. More of this. Awesome. Give me all of the bloods. All of it. And your death. I will also accept your death. Okay, there was like one more guy over here. All lonely. Excuse me, lonely. I like you. You're weak. Okay, so I don't know exactly where they might be in here, but they're somewhere around here. Um, I guess we're just gonna still head in this direction. If McCullum really drank the blood of King Arthur, then I may have found another vital ingredient for my recipe. Okay. We yeah we we kind of we knew don't that. Come closer, sir. Okay. Leech spoiled. Oh jeez. Oh god, there's way way too many of you. No, Lord, don't give us strength. Back in the grave. Okay, well, I got one of them. Filthy fucking beast. That's rude. Remember your vows, friends. Ow. Down one priest guy. Okay. Nope, nope, nope. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Everybody. Ha 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 ha. Ow! How did you even do that? Blood, 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 yummy, yummy blood. Get away from me, get away from me, get away from me. Okay, okay, just you and me now, dude. No, I'm not. I don't. I don't want to date you, sir. Okay. No, you won't. Yeah, that's right. You missed. Ow. Okay, we got that going. Let's pin it down. No, no. Hang on, I was trying to use my ability. There we go. There we go. Oh my god. I know, I'm super weak. So terrible. I can't believe I'm doing this. I don't know why you'd think that you, uh... Can't believe you're doing this, because it's not exactly odd. You've been doing it all game. Jeffrey! Jeffrey! 
Can I call you Jeffrey? Is it gonna be weird? Somebody's making growly noises. You guys missed one. I wonder if he's in the- there's a, that mausoleum where all those dead people were. If I can find it. You know what else is really- like, this is cool, watch. Dyson Delaney. The graves of the people who die in the game show up here, and I think that's pretty awesome. Are you hanging out here? Oh, he is. Hey. Hey, dude. Good evening, Vampire Hunter. Are you here to end me, Leech? You'll find I will not be killed easily. Not at uh, all, Uh, no? McCullum. I am here because I need you. Really? I'm intrigued. Speak up, then. I need the blood of a king. The blood of Arthur. I'm certain you possess it, and I must have it. The guard's most sacred and precious relic. Why would you... Ah. Uh, you found Marshall's memoirs. I should have destroyed that book. I need the antidote to save this city, McCollum. It is within me to take your words as truth. I want to. But I must know more. What precisely are your plans? Um, I must stop a disaster I can stop- yeah, let's stop the disaster! A creature called a disaster is about to be unleashed. It falls upon me, as once it did Marshall, to stop it before the whole country is ravaged. I should have destroyed that book. And yet, I wish I could join this battle alongside you. But this crusade is not mine to fight. Do you not understand? We wanted the same thing from the outset. A means to end this vampire epidemic. Not enemies. Maybe that is so. Yay! You're gonna give it to me? Take it then. I see no other hope for this city. If this is some trick, you will be damned, Dr. Reed. Can, can we have some, some more words? Thank you. Can we speak more? Indeed. Why not? Well, thank you. What'd you come here for? Why are you here? The man who raised me after the brutal murder of my parents. He's buried here. Oh god, did, did vampires kill your parents? Were both your parents killed by vampires? Yes. And yet worse. My father returned to Dublin a vampire. I tore out my mother's throat. Oh, that is terrible. I'm sorry. Who, uh, who helped you out? And who was this man? Carl Eldritch. One-time leader of Prewin. He killed my father in front of me. Helped me hunt my brother Ain after teaching me how to kill leeches. Oh, that's, uh... It's kind of terrible. What will the guard of Prewin do now? Will you stop the Great Hunt? Yes. But we shall continue to protect innocents from beasts like you. And your red-headed friend. Uh, me? I am not mur- Well, okay, there was that one guy. But I, I'm not murdering people. Like me. I am indebted to you for sparing me at Pembroke. But this won't always be the case. I'm no coward like those St. Paul's Stowe brothers. Okay, do, um, have, have you seen her by any chance? How long have you known Lady Ashbury? Where is she? And what will you do to her? We saw you meeting her, so of course we investigated. But she is gone. Our scouts reported she has sold some paintings and departed for an unknown destination. Oh, well, okay then. Adieu, vampire. Oh my. Until yes. we meet again. Adieu. Blood drinker. Getting all fancy with our goodbyes with him. Okay, well, since I'm in Whitechapel, might as well take this way over. Um, of course, I need I need the map because I'm terrible at directions. Sorry, sir. No, a leech, a leech. Yeah, yeah. Leave me alone. Steady, boys. We've 
one of them. No, we don't. We don't have anyone. Leave me alone. No, you don't take me anywhere. I want to go with you. Good grief, they're everywhere. Get in weapons ready. We found one. No, you didn't. I found you. Oh. Oh, oh, oh my. Oh my. Oh my. That's a big boy. Okay, where is the... Way through here. Uh, this way. Um, ow! That was really, really rude. Okay, I'm going back to the hospital on accident. Oh well. Uh, not backwards, Jonathan. Okay. Well. Uh. I'll just go this way then. Seems the seems the best route. So, Lord Redgrave, I doubt, is going to give us anything without a fight at this point. Uh, I mean, I just, I, I just don't see him doing that. I guess it's possible, but we ticked him off pretty dang good. I'm staying as far back as absolutely possible as I leave the area. I'm going the yes, I am going the right way. Okay. What are you doing, Jonathan? What are you doing? I'm sorry. This one's a what? I have no idea what he just called me. I feel like I should be irritated by it. I'm assuming he insulted me. Okay, we're we're in serious condition here. Everybody suddenly got sick. So, who is all sick? My mother, that cool guy, the the uh, police officer, the weirdos. That horrible lady, my friend and his wife, and Mr. Monopoly Man. Okay. Good evening, Mr. Kamur. Good. Do you need medical? Don't believe that I'm the kind. Uh, There's so? No need to be ashamed. I'm not. I don't have a fragile constitution. Just give me, give the medicine. Thing. Yes. Goodbye, Mr. Kamura. Take. Okay. And my buddy's over here. Whose blood could be- Good evening, old chap. I won't lie to you, Johnny. I'm not a well man. Um, well, we Do know you that. Need medical assistance? It's a little late for vi- What can I say? I hope we're talking about the same habits, old friend. You need some rest. Yeah, you really do need to get some rest, sir. It would probably be best, and your wife may hate you less. Can't I just give her the medicine at the door? Wouldn't that be better? Hello. I'm so sorry for your loss, Jonathan. Oh my god, woman, stop talking about it. What do you need? Do you need my medic? It would appear that old ha Uh, I don't have treatment for a headache? I will see you later. I thought I had all Goodbye. the treatments. But apparently I am missing one. I'm just gonna have to remember when Mary came go to my room. Okay, so you guys are all taken care of except for her. She needs headache medicine. You're not sick. 
Was she sick? She's not sick. Do you have a stomachache, sir? From all the all the fooding you're doing. You would save my life. Don't worry. There is nothing serious. I cannot imagine the pain these people must face then. Goodbye, Mr. Okay, goodbye, sir. Here's my house. Mother! Mother, are you ill? I will take care of you. Hello again. Jonathan, back already? Yes, I'm Do back already. Please don't go outside. Oh, you... I think you should take this. I'm not sure I'll ever feel better. You'll, Goodbye, you will. Mother. Um, You'll feel better, Goodbye, I promise. Son. Please come back soon. I, w I will, Mom. I gotta go sleep now. You know, not really, but... Okay. My hideous desk in my beautiful room. Okay. There's my headache medicine. I could... Okay, now I'm paranoid I don't have enough for anybody. So you're done, you're done. You have... Okay, one... Two, three fatigues. A cold and a headache. Three fatigues, a cold and a headache. Okay, I don't know why I thought I had an extra one when I apparently did not. Where am I going? The stairs are this way. Okay, so... We've got... Run! She needs our assistance with her headache! Hello, John. At least you survived the Great War. I did survive the Great War. What do you need? Didn't survive me, London, though. Do you need? It would appear that old habits die hard, my dear. And I'm happy to give it to you, as always. Th yeah. Goodbye. Thank you. Thank you for your patronage. Alright, now I've got to remember how to get back over to the where the uh police guy is. Oh yeah, he's in the he's in the other neighborhood. He's up here. So it'd be best just to go to the right, all the way around. Oh look! Jerks. Excuse me, sirs. No! I don't answer to you. Stupid new Shut up! That's what you get. Smack you. Uh where did the, where did what the where did he go? Okay. We have disappearing bad guys. That's... Well, that's worrisome. Okay, where is he? There he is! Too many murders to investigate them all. Dr. Reed. Yes, um, what about your investigations? What are you investigating, exactly? Well, my two... I oh, okay. Why do I still... I don't think so. Nothing else. Do you okay. Need I'm afraid I'm at. Here you go, man. You quickly feel better after taking this. Thank you, Doctor Reed. I really appreciate it. Goodbye, Detective. You know, I have wondered what I'm actually Goodbye, giving these Dr. people. Jonathan Reed. It's like it's probably I'm cocaine. Sure we'll talk again soon. Like that's just what I'm I'm giving out to everybody. Oh, you have a headache? Have some cocaine. <laughs> oh, it's these two that were sick too, wasn't it? 
They are. Come here. Come here. Come here. Don't leave. Hello again, Doc. Hello. Do you need my Indeed. You have nothing. Sounds so easy to fight disease. Too bad it's not the same making people smile again. God, Goodbye you guys are now, weird. Hello again. I didn't want to talk to you. Goodbye for now, Mr. Baker. I'm talking to your brother. Good evening, Mr. Baker. Hmm. Why do I always... I don't know. Do you need my medical attention, sir? I'm... I don't want to appear tactless, says the doctor who also works outside at night. Ooh. Goodbye, Mr. Baker. He told you, man. Okay. Back the way we came. Let's go have a word with Redgrave. I feel like maybe I should sleep, though. Like, it might be a good idea to go in there at full health. I don't care! Uh, I don't care either. Please leave me alone. Steady, boys! We've got away one. with you! Okay. Away with me. Please don't follow me. You told me to go away. I'm going. Alright, I, I worry that more people will get sick if I sleep, but I really want to make sure that I'm healthy. So, I'm going to take a nap. I could use a serum, but that seems wasteful. Besides, this is a very nice bed. You'd hate to go to waste. There is certainly nothing that I can really upgrade unless I want to upgrade science. But... The following night. Oh, I forgot that lady. Oh, well, the district's healthy. She's fine. You're still critical, but we're okay. Still healthy. You're not murdering people in the night, apparently. I'll, you know, go with that. Everybody's, everybody's okay, except for you. And I don't like her. She abuses her daughter. So, you know what? She can stay sick. Absolutely nothing lost in that if, uh, if she dies from fatigue or whatever she has. Okay, no blood, but I am healthy. Are not well. Oh, I'm. I apparently need to go in the back door. It's like they probably didn't lock the back. Actually, they might have locked the back. I don't know. They might not be able to get in. They never thought someone would come in through the back door. They didn't. They didn't lock the door. That's hilarious. I'm and still persona non grata in the Ascalon Club. If I want to speak with Lord Redgrave, I'll have to improvise. You, you mean kill everybody? Because that's, I'm pretty sure that's what that means. You cannot win this! You- Ow! Gotcha. No you don't! Okay. Um, I don't like you. Okay, here we go. Get some health. Get some health. Get some health. 
Excuse me? So rude. Could you please load your dang gun a little bit faster? Okay then, my goodness. Everybody is such higher level than me. This is what I get for not eating people. So, Lord Redgrave, sir. Is that a person in there? No. I just steal this. Maybe he is in his office. Oh, maybe he's in the, he's in the basement. He might be in the basement. I'll check the office though. That is a shiny cabinet. Full of grease. Okay, I'm going to assume that he's down in the basement. Doing some sort of creepy blood ritual. Because that's what you do. Oh, apparently not. Never mind. Uh, hi. Good evening, Lord Redgrave. What are you doing here, traitor? I shall smite you for this audacity. I'm not here to bicker, Lord Redgrave. I can put an end to this epidemic, but I need your assistance to do so. Good. We've held out thus far, but the time has come to put an end to this crisis. What? Tell me, what do you need? The blood of William Marshall. The blood of William Marshall? Of my maker? Are you mad? His blood is the purest of all. My maker profited to me on the battlefield. I cannot hand it to you. Um, oh god, I don't know if I should call him out on it, but... Yeah, but, because they're all about the, you know... I... This is more important than the club you or me. This is London's last hope. I see. Well, in that case, given the gravity of the situation, I suppose I can spare you a drop. Thank you, my lord. If you manage to save this city, you'll prove yourself a veritable servant of the crown. So Godspeed, Dr. Reed. Our fate lies wholly in your hands. Yeah, because you guys won't lift a dang finger or do anything helpful. Okay, well that was much easier than I thought I was going to have to kill this dude. Can I go out the front door now? Is anybody else going to try to kill me for being in the house? No good. I find a hideout. I guess I can just go to my house. Probably would work perfectly well. I can't, I don't see why not. You see, Fletz were telling the truth all along. Women of Nobody all takes them seriously. Unite. Yeah, that's true. I want to, but she have any... Did I try this already? I don't remember. Do you have anything to say about your mom? Good evening, Miss Ashbury. And good evening to you, Dr. Reed. Nope, apparently Goodbye, not. Charlotte. She's been... Did you know your mother skipped town? Because that seems like something that she might want to let you know about. The place where I did my first medical studies. 
My first experiment. My bedroom. Absolutely. I shall make Why the antidote not? here. Felt like it needed sound effects. I don't know why I'm even bothering to do this, but I feel like I should. I don't need money, really. Don't, nope, I'm not gonna break down Jonathan's watch. It's sentimental. Okay, so let's make one of these. Okay, I've got good, good doses of my serums. Because I like being prepared. Okay. The blend seems stable. Time to go and find Harriet in the sewers. Ooh! Okay, that's something. Talk to Harriet. Um, there is an entrance to the sewers nearby, wasn't there? Guinea pig. Oh, reach the hive. Sounds awful to call it that, but. I'm sorry, is the music rather intense? Feeling like the music is a little bit too, uh... Da -da -da. I didn't know this entrance was over here. Thank you, map and compass, for helping me out. Embankment sewers, critical. Oh god, what about Harriet? What has she done? Okay. Or is it just because this is where the skulls live that it's... I have no idea. Am I going? I'm gonna get lost in here, I know it. We've got blood. Well, it's not interesting blood apparently, but it's still blood. It's all over the walls. Is this... Where I, yeah, still don't know where... Oh, oh okay. I, I remember that area. Do I need to go through that? I... I don't like open areas. I feel like something's about to like attack me, so I don't really want to go in there. I will if I need to. Nom 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 nom. I have this thirst for blood. So creepy and quiet down here. Oh, okay. No, I, I definitely. This is. Um, okay. I need to go through that area. This is where I first came through the sewers. At least now I'm kind of fam in familiar territory about which direction I need to be going.
Okay. Goodbye, my rat friends. I'm sorry I had to kill your brother. Or... Wait a second. Or did I fall down here and this was the way out? I don't think there's any other way out of here. There's... Oh, wait. There is this one. Okay. This is looking correct, I think. Okay. Oh. This place has been ransacked. Yes, it has. Oh boy. I'm just checking for survivors. Hopefully, I won't get attacked by anybody, but. That's what I'm hoping to find is anybody still alive? Because I liked these guys down here, they didn't want to hurt anybody. God, what about Bridget? Okay, well, there's my... Harriet? Where has Harriet gone? She must have left a trail I could find. she write a letter? You leave a note. She must have left a trail, huh? Oh, this goopy trail? This bloody goopy trail? Yeah, probably. They've all been slaughtered. Prewen. No, not their style. I'm, I'm sorry. Slaughtered is not the Prewen's style? Because that seems to be what they do? Why you would think otherwise? Okay, we've still... Oh, uh, oh. Where is old Bridget? Damn. If I'd come earlier, they would still be alive. Well, yes, that's true. Maybe. Or you might be dead. Any number of things could have happened if you came earlier. Um. Oh dear. Uh, hi dad. How you doing? Take not a step further, child, for you are unprepared. You, at last. I wondered when you would show your face again. Step away. We have nothing to discuss. Desist, child. You cannot confront the monstrosity unleashed upon this land without due preparation. I shall not allow it. All right. But no more riddles. Okay. Enough of the obscure songs and prophecies. Yeah, just talk to me, dude. I ask questions, and you answer them. My words have been as clear as crystal lakes, my child. You seem unwilling to drink, to listen, to learn. Yeah, why did you pick me? Why did you choose me? Only you could provide a modern, scientific answer to this ancient, mystical threat. Yeah, so, yes, yeah, science? What kind of modern answer? Medicine. Disease, contagion, and contamination. How they course through veins is your dominion, my child. Your choices have made you. Only you can save this land. 
Yeah, but what is this ancient threat? Speak to me of this ancient threat. The blood of hate. Vessel of the wrath of the goddess. When she awakens, a disaster will be born into this world, for she is hunger and anger. Hey. What is your true appearance? I do not understand. This is who I am. Uh, are, are, so are you made of blood? Blood? You are made of blood? Surely you are joking. Why would I? And no, I'm not made of blood. I am blood. Blood is what I am since my birth and for eternity. I'm sorry, what? But who are you really? Tell me your name. I am your maker. I am the servant of the Red Goddess and protector of this land. I have many names. Just give me one, then. There are those who call me Murdin Wild, the Wild Horned Man. But I never was a man. I was born out of blood. Okay. I'm here to stop Harriet Jones. She is the original carrier. The well from which this corruption flows. I have heard you, but be wary. Harriet Jones's mind is no more. She has metamorphosed into an apocalypse. Born from, drenched in, and driven by the blood of hate. Yeah, I, uh... Yeah, what is this blood of hate? What is the blood of hate? It is the curse of the goddess. It is the hunger in you. The need for blood. The will to strike and to punish. To spit in the eye of God. Okay. Tell me about this disaster, creature. I know London fell victim to such a thing in 1666. A disaster is pure anger born through blood. Its name means bad star, for they only appear when our queen unleashes her unquenchable wrath upon the world. So she's your queen, but you're also trying to stop this, and I am so confused. And who is this queen? She is the Red Goddess, the Queen of Blood. In my youth, a hundred lifetimes ago, she was worshipped as the Morrigan. She is my mother. She is yours, too. The Morrigan? The Celtic goddess of war? Is this a ruse of some kind? She has been worshipped in many forms throughout the ages. The true nature of the Red Queen is beyond your comprehension, eluding even mine. But know this. She is a vengeful mother. Okay. So the disaster is some sort of accident. A disease vampires carry dormant in their blood, waiting to emerge. That's your modern answer. But a disaster is at the same time both less and more. Tell me what it is then, in your own words. A disaster is the pure will of our queen. Whenever she dreams of walking this earth, she awakes in this putrid vessel. Why? I only wish to know how to put an end to this epidemic. To perform an act so noble, you must protect yourself from its poisonous kiss, my child. I know. McCullum used such a serum when trying to kill me. However, I have produced a more efficacious version of the antidote. Your final task awaits you at the end of these tunnels. I've known for ages you were worthy of this challenge. My champion, Bittersweet. Okay, my champion, Bittersweet. God, you're so weird. What will happen thereafter? What future awaits me beyond these dark tunnels? Your fate, my child, and the fate of this land. A disaster is about to enter this world to smite us all and teach us humility. 
You are our final hope. Do we not need a bit of humility? Will it be over then? Once I've defeated this creature? Yes. The threat will dissipate like so much smoke. For you will have purified its source. And then what? What will become of me? How would I know? I am no god, and your fate is in your own hands. For you are our champion. I am not your champion. Why can't it be like, yes, I will champion this? You tricked me. My sister died for your schemes. I have brought suffering and tragedy into this world. I am not, nor will I ever be your champion. Very soon you'll come to know that sacrifice is sometimes necessary. I understand the grudge a child bears towards his father and mother. Be brave, my child. Okay, Dad. Thanks for that. Now, I am curious because is is the um Okay, so I can't equip the it's not something that I need to equip, which is good because I'd be worried about attempting to use it in battle. Gee, is she possibly in the direction of the trail of bodies? Oh. These poor skulls didn't stand a chance. No, they didn't. Jeez. Harry, uh, gross. I'll be glad to be of assistance. Ah, oh, like your help, Doris. Liars! All of you! <coughs> Ew! Stop that! <coughs> My poor baby. I've been such a bad mother. You really have. You, you really have. The Queen herself forgave me. Gave me another chance. Harriet. You must stop all of this. I can't let you infect anyone else. How dare you interfere with the Red Queen's plans, Doctor? How can you stop the course of nature? Oh, God, quit it. God, I could see up her dress. It was so creepy. Oh, ew. Lord. Ew, stop it, woman. You are so gross. Okay, was that, was that it? Ew! Um... Get away from me. Blood, feed me, give me their lives. 
No, don't do that. Ew, get away from me, ladies of blood. Out of stamina. They are so young, so tasty. Okay. I don't like you. Ow! What the No, don't feed my mother. Okay, okay, okay. Ow. Ow, ow, ow. Get away from me. Oh, jeez. You have... Oh, God. Okay, this is not good. This is not good. Okay, okay, yes, yes, such innocence and guilt, ma'am. Get away from me. Oh. Oh, you were not near me. So young and tasty. Awesome. You're so weird. Stop smacking me, you weird blood ladies! Oh, dang it! Get away from me, woman! Ever defeat you, mother of us all, 
For you are our every root and leaf. You've always been my most amusing son. Okay. Then go back to sleep, my queen. And smile at us from your dreams. Did they feel my wrath? Have they suffered enough? Yes. More than ever, mother of us all. Until the next time. Until the next time. Oh. Oh. Okay. That... That's it? So, it's over then, Young Echo. You have put an end to this terrible menace. Old Bridget? What are you doing here? This is my realm, Ekon. This is Suaskal territory. But they were all massacred by the monstrosity that Harriet became. Others will come, engendered by deceitful vampires. I don't mean you, of course. Oh, thank you. That's nice. I thought you'd been slaughtered with all the other sewer skulls. I was up above, in search of help when Harriet suddenly turned into that thing. I have no idea what it was. It's over now. London is no longer shrouded in the disaster's shadow. We're all safe. Yes. You prevailed in the end. I hope you'll forgive me for the way I treated you when first you presented yourself at our oh, gate. Oh, sure. No need to apologize. Really. Perhaps there will be no stories told or songs sung of what happened here today. But I'll know the truth. Jonathan Reed, newborn vampire, stepped forward and saved us all. Well, I'm you're welcome. I'm honored to be part of this city's legend. Thank you, old Bridget. May I ask you just one question? How could I refuse you anything now? I'll answer just as I answered Lady Ashbury when we met a few nights ago. Who are you? Really? I was born with the name Bridget Eleanor Wellington. In 1738, my beloved and immortal husband decided to preserve my beauty and youth forever by making me drink his blood. You were Lord Redgrave's yep. wife. That's what I figured. Then the pompous fool rejected you, did he not? It was about 200 years ago. Peace found me in time. And I sincerely hope it will find you too, now that all is over. No, it's not over. I may have ended the vampire epidemic, but I still need answers from the woman I love. I feared you would say that. Go then. Young Ekon, and face your fate. Just remember that I'll always be here for you. Oh, well, thank you. That's very sweet of you. I'll come visit, I promise. London has been cleansed. This catastrophe came about when an ancient malignant will crossed paths with mortal imprudence. For now, we are safe. For now. My craving for blood remains. Red like hate, red like hunger, red as life and death, passing from one immortal to another, from predator to victim, patiently biding its time to rise again. London has been cleansed for now, but there's a simmering hatred, fear, and old grudges. When will we succumb, mortals and immortals alike? The next disaster is only a matter of time. My only hope now is to catch the woman I love, to understand why she fled, and unmask the secret that has been lurking in her blood for so long. Yes, please, unmask the secret. I want to know. Oh, we're at some pretty little ruin. Doesn't seem to be the time of day you should be out and about, Jonathan. Well, 
This is it. Lady Ashbury's domain. Why am I not surprised it's not on any maps? I'd better hurry. Uh, yeah, let's hurry. Oh my gosh. Find out why. Well, you know what? Actually, we're not. We're gonna save that for one more... Well, maybe. I don't know. I don't know how lot many chapters this uh, game actually goes through. But we're here now, and we're gonna end this episode here. We'll find out what Lady Ashbury has to say in the next episode. So thanks, everybody, for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!